so now what we will do uh, we will add one more row type equal to text value on change we will call one function update value here what we are passing and to differentiate we will pass the title as we have four field uh, second one is info third one is price last one is company now we are calling some function price then company using so we have to add one button as well to this row so let's add one TV again here button this button we have already imported from the bootstrap library along with the table we pass value dot id so if we have value dot id then we will add a button as a cell otherwise we will have a button like add new row so now uh, what we will do uh, we have to focus on first edit functionality so uh, once we click on the particular row that row should be appear in the text field so let's start with to uh, the context js let's add more state it initially blank title initially blank info initially blank company initially blank and one more is update edit this will be useful later on so let's create this one so text one edit we are using ESX. We are passing the ID as well. So now um, const let's take the case dot state dot time product to this dot state dot all data. Then index of is dot get. Now we have to write one function. We have we have to pass the ID. So we have to write one more function over here. Get get record. We are we are getting the ID from where it is getting called. Now const product equal to this dot state dot all data dot end term equal to as dot id is equal to equal to given it and just we have to pass this uh, return the product. So now in the index we have the product then selected product ten product of index now so this dot set state 
So we, what we have done as of now, uh, on the click of edit, we have just passing the values, whatever the values we have for a particular row, uh, take those values in the home. So let's check it if we have a UI in, so nothing is happening as we have on value, it is not a function. So why it is showing is like this. Uh, as we have to pass this function into the value so uh, on edit this dot on edit let's just remove this one now let's check again yes now you can see when we click over here uh, the values are changing because we are passing the id when we click on on edit and based on that we are putting all fetching the all record from the global state that is a uh, all data and from that all data as you can see here we have a written one function get record so means we are passing that id to the get record from that we are fetching the single record setting the values to the state and from the state we are fetching into the home uh, what we have to do uh, once we click on the save we have to save these values to the existing row so let's do this 